Folks, check it out. We have our FD60. This is a VOC, FD-60-VOC wall mount unit connected via 4 to 20 milliamp to a 4 to 20 milliamp display. Now, Dr. Cos, we need to extend the display some distance away from the unit. What can we do? Well, what I tell people is to use a 4 to 20 milliamp display. That's the whole purpose of 420 milliamps. It's a very reliable way to extend your display, to take the signal out from the unit to an extendable display. It could be a display, a recording unit, etc, etc. I'm going to show you exactly how to set it up. And that's the whole purpose. Now, there isn't much setup from the unit itself. 4 milliamps is representative of zero or the minimum value of your um, unit. For example, here, we have the VOC zero. So four milliamps going out represents zero on the display. <clears throat> this is 100 ppm max. So that means 20 milliamp will be max on the unit. Okay, folks. So that's the way it works. Now, if you look carefully, I'm going to zoom in here so you can see what's going on. Now, in our unit, on the black wire, we have our ground. On the far most we have our plus 24 volt DC, okay? And in the middle, and in the middle right there, we have, as you could probably see, it says S, that's the middle right there. That's the second terminal from the right. One, two, three. Two, the second from the right is our four to 20 milliamp signal, okay? And ground. So we tap off both of them and we're sending actually in this case we're sending power to the unit ground and the signal so three wires are going to the unit this is a standard 4 to 20 milliamp unit and at the back you can see at the back you can see power ground milliamp signal in and in this case we're just shorting both the voltage and the milliamp as requested okay folks now it's a great little unit and i'll give you a quick demo on how to do it now you don't have to do much to set this guy up you just turn it on and you're off to the races. Um, and it gives you a nice way of extending the display. Now, just give me a minute here. I'm just going to um, put this screen on. So as you can see, we have a gas calibration bottle, isobutylene for um, VOC. It's connected to the calibration cap and straight onto the central head, okay? As this increases, you will see a corresponding increase on the external 4 to 20 milliamp um, display. Okay, let's pop in some gas. There it goes. And it tracks each other one to one. It's a beautiful setup. Very, very straightforward. Now, I'm gonna turn that off and I'm just gonna simply <clears throat> leave it like that because we need to talk about a few things. Now, if for example, we are doing oxygen, oxygen is 20.9 on the display, it will send out the corresponding current for 20.9. Now, there are functions in this guy to do gain adjustments, offset adjustments, and things like that. So you can, you can have the actual display mimic, mimic the actual range, the exact ppm or percent volume concentration of the gas but again you'll have to tweak it because this guy 4 to 20 means 4, min, 4 milliamps is the minimum range and 20 milliamps is the maximum range okay of this unit again for example if we are doing oxygen 0 to 30 percent 0 percent on this guy's 4 milliamps 30 percent will be 40 40, uh, excuse me, 20 milliamps will be 30%, okay? So in other words, if I plug it all in and it's showing me on the display 20.9%, this will not be showing 20.9%. It will be showing the corresponding proportional current in that range. And you'll have to get into the sequence of gain and offsets to make it read 20.9. I hope that makes sense, folks, okay? So please read up further about how to do that on the web, on Google, 4 to 20 milliamps. This is standard process control stuff, okay? Nothing different, nothing elaborate, nothing we're doing any different from any other people using these type of instrumentation uh, products. Okay, folks, look, I hope that helps. But again, the solution to expending, extending your display is to use a 4 to 20 milliamp um, little display gadget like this. That is the solution. Till then, be well, be safe, and see you soon.